Ladies and gentlemen, please welcome TV presenter and talk sport radio DJ all the way from London, George Lamb. Wow. Hello, Liverpool. How are we doing, everybody? We all right? Very good. Not sure if there's enough of you here, actually. Um, thank you. Uh, thank you for having me. Big thank you to Jimmy uh, for driving me uh, up the ramp there. Jimmy's been here 43 years, man and boy. How about that, huh? I thought it was a little bit strong that he tried to charge me 20 quid for the lift, but I won't hold it against him. Uh, now, of course, uh, this is our first, this is the number one Range Rover Evoque off the production line, guys. This is what we're here to celebrate today. Uh, so please put your hands together for this beautiful piece of machinery. Well done to you all. Uh, you are very much in business now. And by way of starting the celebration, I wanted to welcome up a man who watches over you every day like a young shepherd tending to his flock. Uh, it's your, uh, your plant director. Please welcome to the stage, who else uh, but Richard Else. Hello, thank sir. You, How are you doing? You. Good, thank you. Uh, Richard, you must be so proud. This is a fantastic achievement. Really, really delighted that we're, we're here today. I want to thank all of the Halewood team for all of their efforts so far that's, that's got us to this momentous day. Some of the faces you'll see on the board behind are just a fraction of the people who've contributed to the success of this product over the last three years. And I'd like to thank each and every one of them. We said we'd deliver it on the 4th of July, and we've delivered it on the 4th of July. Well done, sir. Congratulations, and congratulations to all you guys as well. Richard, thank you very much. I wish you the best of luck. Thank you. Congratulations. Thank you. Richard Else, everybody. Uh, now, of course, it's not every day that a wonderful car like this comes off the production line, uh, so uh, please put your hands together for Dr. Ralph Speth, the CEO of Land Rover. <laughs> Welcome to the stage. Dr. Uh, Dr. Speth. What does the Evoke mean for, uh, for the business? I guess for us it's a historical moment. It's an exciting vehicle, exactly at the right time, in a very exciting moment. This Evoke does have all the DNA, all the attributes and specification to be really a Range Rover. And so also from my side, thank you to everybody involved in that project. Uh, now, of course, this is the first one off the production line. I found myself leaning on it there, and I, I had to stop myself. I'm sorry about that. Um, <laughs> uh, and, uh, and I also wanted to talk to you about the, uh, the figures that came out for, uh, for last year. Very impressive. One billion profits. Yeah, I guess, uh, Ravi, I guess we think we did quite well. I hope at least <laughs> you think about it in that way. Overall, um, it was a great year. And also in that context, thank you to all of you. Because at the end of the day, business is people. And only if we stick together as a team, we really can make it happen. And you should know the Vogue is just the start. We do have the most ambitious product program for both Jaguar and Land Rover ahead of us. And I would like to take the opportunity to say thank you very much to Tata. Because without the Tata company, without Ratan Tata, who started the initiative, and without Ravi Kant, who started the whole transformation, I guess we all would not stand or sit here. And therefore, I would like to take the opportunity to ask Ravi Kant and Carl Peter Forster on stage to say some words in this kind of very historical moment. So please, Peter, please, Ravi, come on stage. Um, it is an important step forward for our company because we reach out into new segments, into new territory. It will boost our volume, it will boost employment, and it hopefully will boost profit. But that's <laughs> clearly your task and your job. I would, again, thank everybody involved in this project, the many people here on this side who are working hard every day, many people who are not here in this room but watching it on the screen, and the many people in Gaiden on the engineering and in all the functions who have delivered the project so far. One word of, I call it caution, perhaps a little bit. For most observers from the outside, the job is done now. I think, Ralph, we are sort of veterans of the car industry and most people here are also with the business for a long time. We all know it's an important milestone. We still have to ramp up the production. Um, we know that we will deliver to the highest quality standards and we have full trust in the team here that you will do so. And then we have to bring the vehicle in the right quantities to our dealers. And so it's a lot of work still ahead of us, but we trust 
that you, this team here, and the many other people who are not here in the room today, will deliver. So, thank you very much for what you have achieved. We have full trust in you. This is a great opportunity. As you said, let's go ahead. Ravi. Thank you. <laughs> thank you, Peter. On behalf of uh, Mr. Ratan Tata and the Board of Directors of Tata Motors, I would like to congratulate and compliment uh, the entire Jaguar Land Rover for this beautiful product which is we all see here, and we do hope that in a year's time, it would have created quite a sensation in the marketplace. Thank you very much. Big thank you to our board there. Ladies and gentlemen, we will not take up any more of your time. Thank you very much for being here, and, uh, and here's to Halewood and the Evoke. Thank you. Thanks very much.